Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Bitcoin and Ethereum daily update. By the time you see the video, it might be 25 December. I wish you all the best. I wish you Merry Christmas to everybody. We grow together here. I think that you should be having more patience towards the 2022. You can see that the market tries to recover a little bit. And of course, I think that you are going to take amazing profits thank you for watching do not forget to join our monthly subscription patreon slash mind your crypto for even more profits what you will get is an automated system with 200 altcoins you will be able to know exactly when to buy and exactly when to sell you will also get a manual system with over 90 percent win ratio personal guidance every day educational videos to become expert in the technical analysis and hold your future in your hands market updates and many many other benefits thank you for watching have a fantastic day wherever you are let's go to bitcoin right now that we have we actually tested as we talked about in the previous market update it is not necessary that we had this breakout and it wasn't a fake out although if we had this pattern right there and stopped at the 50 day may becoming the support level and then eventually get higher this would be a real breakout and it is i think the next price targets for Bitcoin will be around the 52.6 around there. Okay, we have one major, major resistance level at around this area, right? So therefore, I think that this whole rectangle will be our first major resistance level. Afterwards, I think that we can make it above, we can surpass it, and we may be going into the 55 to 56 Okay, all right. So therefore, this would be the next, the second target. If we go there, for example, if we make a 9% swing high for Bitcoin, then of course we can go even, even higher for altcoins as well. And this will drag up many, many altcoins that are in an extreme oversold situation against Bitcoin as well. Okay, including Link, Aave, Uniswap, all right, SushiSwap, and many, many other altcoins right there. It will drag them upwards. As for some altcoins that have already a very high risk, I'm not sure about that. Okay, you should be careful with Luna and so on. I know that Luna is a great project for the long term, but for the short term, midterm you have a very high risk trust me there mark my words and if you do not sell or you buy now you might regret it all right so therefore let's go back to the good news the bitcoin right here that is going to approach this area of the 52.9 to 53.5 52.6 i would say to 52.9 and of course we have one more very very strong resistance level at around 55 Point eight to 56k i think we can manage to go there but first we have to break this important resistance level this is clearly a breakout this is what happens after a breakout okay we have some lower highs okay you all know that we had this breakout but at the end of the day this wasn't a real breakout until we confirmed that we are having the 50 day ma as a support level and eventually bouncing back okay this confirms that this is a real breakout and the next targets for bitcoin you know that on the time being for the short term we have a very high risk with the four hour frame with the rsi but we do not care about that okay we might be going a little bit sideways a little bit down but it's all good we can go further upwards into higher into the next targets for bitcoin okay so do not worry do not even worry about that stuff right there so we can go even higher and we can go approaching the 50 2 to 53k and 55 to 56k as well for ethereum against bitcoin chart i told you that here we had a bearish rsa divergence okay so this was a bearish rsa divergence clearly and what i'm afraid about ethereum against bitcoin is if we are going to drop even more so if ethereum can't outperform bitcoin then it is going to drop more that doesn't mean though that ethereum against usdt because i will open up ethereum i had gala from before but i will open ethereum um ethereum against usdt doesn't mean that it will go down okay it just means that it will not go as much as high as we expected, all right? So uh, because Bitcoin will be going upwards, it will drag upwards Ethereum against USDT as well. 
okay, but it won't make, at least for now, the swing high that we expect from Ethereum. And you can see that it hasn't made that yet. Yes, we have gone above the 20 day and the 50 day May, but there are many altcoins that have outperformed Ethereum. And of course, Bitcoin as well has totally outperformed Ethereum in the last few hours. Okay, so right there, I think that Ethereum can easily touch the 5K, but it will be a little bit harder and it will slowly go up there. As for Ethereum though, in all these times, it is holding pretty, pretty amazingly good and it hasn't dropped down as much as Bitcoin. So in the previous days, Ethereum outperformed Bitcoin, right? But after all, uh, for Ethereum against Bitcoin, chart this is what matters the most right now that we are probably going to correct and we are going to see if we are going to have a major correction or not i really hope that we can maybe maybe get towards the 20 day and the 50 day MA and from there find the support level just like we did all the times except for, from these two times right here back on 21st of December and back on 22nd March. So even if we go down from the 50 day MA it won't be bearish but if we find resistance on the 50 day MA and we drop down then this will be bearish for sure especially if that happens on the weekly frame. If that, if that happens on the daily frame it is not bearish we have seen that multiple times okay and it's not something that we should be worried about. For the time being though, we closed below the 20 day EMA and here we didn't have, for example, a bearish, I'll say divergence or so, but at the meantime, we are having a little bit of a correction. I hope, I really hope that this is not this weekly bearish uh, RSA right here that we are seeing from this top right there up to this top is not something important and we are going to make a string high right here and go further upwards at least we have a major correction after we go and outperform more bitcoin okay so right there this is what i'm hoping for this is what i'm rooting for ethereum against bitcoin chart we are going to see though and ethereum i think will be easily going to 5k if bitcoin goes towards 55 to 56k bitcoin's dominance is decreasing over these last few days but i think dominance uh, bitcoin will get back its dominance and go for sure into the higher targets that we have for bitcoin as well merry christmas to everybody again i hope you are, you are having a fantastic day do not forget to join our monthly subscription patreon slash mind your crypto you can cancel anytime you like and of course see you soon with many many more videos bye